Hey yo, what's up everybody, Holmes here and welcome back to some more Neo 2 boss guides. Today we're going to be taking on the Yatsu no Kami. And before we take them on, I want to show you guys these uh, snake statues that you can destroy. Alright, this will get rid of the poison puddle in the boss room. If you just ran straight for the boss and you'll notice there's going to be three poison puddles. And those are going to fuck with your shit because uh, it's you're going to have to watch out not to step on those. Or if you do, you're gonna have to use antidote. If not, your health will keep draining. So yeah, it's it's pretty annoying. So I highly recommend you guys take down these snake statues first. I'm showing these off because I'm I'm pretty sure if I don't, people are gonna ask why is no poison puddles in my boss room. So yeah, there they are, all three. And this is the shrine right before the boss. Okay, so you'll see this once you once you reach this point. You have to see it. It's on the left side of the boss room. So, anyways, here we go. Boss fights. He always starts off the fight with the dash, so you can dodge it by do doing a diagonal left dodge or just doing a left dodge. Tail sweep, you can dodge into it. Um, the grab, you can also dodge into it. Um, the snake arms that he has, it's actually a separate like enemy. You can actually kill it at this point before going into the Yokai realm. Uh, if you don't kill it before we enter the Yokai realm, that he forces us into. Oh, this is a body stand, by the way. Um, you can counter burst it. He has two red attacks a uh, body slam and a rush. Alright, so if you're close, it's most likely a body slam. Alright, so there we go. He forces us into the Yokai realm. We didn't break the snakes. Well, we didn't kill the snakes, so therefore they are now able to walk freely in the Yokai realm. If you kill the snakes, he'll be just, you know, he doesn't have any little snake arms in the normal realm. And But once he enters Yokai realm and he leaves Yokai realm, he'll spawn another pair of snakes. So it's a rinse and repeat process. So I highly recommend you guys kill the snakes first before trying to kill him. Um, well, before trying to bring him into the Yokai realm. His attacks doesn't really change. There's no new attacks. The only thing that's like new is, like I said, if you don't break the the arms, they become like different enemies, which is not too much of a threat because they don't really have much health. But it's just you know you gotta watch out because there's three enemies now. Body slam counter. Alright, we broke the stamina, so we can get a critical now. Uh, don't stick around after you do that because it's gonna wake up with yeah the tail spin attack and that can actually hurt you so don't stick around. <laughs> Alright, he, sh he shoves his uh, snakes into the ground. Watch out because um you know snakes pop up. This needle thing and dodge through it. Um, what else we got? Tail spin. Nothing to it. I would focus down again. Cool. Oh, but we didn't get to down him before. The into is your guy now. So now we're gonna have to deal with the snakes again. Let's see what? It's kind of a pain because you have to watch out for the boss because he hits hard, and especially if he grabs you. I don't know if you have the HP to survive it because I don't. <laughs> if he grabs me, it's over. Fight's over. Poke attack. Let's see, you gotta watch out for all these like combos and stuff. Oh, we got it. We got it. Oh shit. Yeah, this is annoying. I mean, you don't take out the snakes. And I feel like I'm a little bit under level for this. I'm, I don't know. Maybe I am, maybe I'm not. I don't know. And there's the rush red attack. You can also call out first counter. Basically, stay close, watch out for the tail sweeps, and watch out for the grabs. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Once you get rid of the snakes, he's uh, pretty much a cakewalk. Until he spawns them back again, then. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't have much moves. 
So you see the snake to the ground attack and the two snakes pop up and then you can go in and hit him. Tail slam. That one you can do diagonal left dodge and just get close to him and he'll be fine. Like get towards like his back area once. You can kinda see it because he kinda He rears up for it. Yeah. That's pretty much it for the Yatsuno Kami. This was actually one of the demo bosses. So yeah, and I had a hard time with him when, when I first fought him. There we go. And Yeah, that's pretty much gonna wrap it up for this video. So I thank you all so very much for watching. Um here's my stats if you want to see it and yeah like i said that's it that's all thank you all so very much for watching hopefully this video has been entertaining or helpful or enjoyable and we all found at least one of those qualities to be in this video and hey stay tuned for more but until next time i'll catch y'all later homes out